In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to save your Office Word files to your local PC instead of OneDrive. Whether you're working on a personal project or managing important documents, understanding where your files are stored is crucial for accessibility and security. Saving directly to your PC can be a game changer, especially if you're working offline or prefer to have all your documents organized in one place on your hard drive. Let's dive right into the step-by-step -step process. First, open your Word document. You can do this by launching Microsoft Word and selecting the document you want to open from the list of recent files, or by navigating through your file explorer to find it. Once your document is open and ready, we'll move on to the next step. Next, we'll go to the file menu located in the upper left corner of the screen. This menu is the gateway to all your document management tasks, from saving and printing to sharing your files. Click on File and you're going to look for the option that says Save As. This is different from just Save as it allows you to select the location and potentially rename the file as needed. When you click Save As, a dialog box will appear. Here's where you can choose where to save your document. Now by default, Word may suggest saving to OneDrive, especially if you're using an Office account linked to it. To change this, click on This PC. Selecting this PC directs Word to save the file onto your local computer storage, bypassing OneDrive entirely. Once you've clicked this PC, it's time to choose a specific folder on your computer to save the document. This could be a folder in your Documents, Desktop, or maybe a special project folder where you keep your Word documents. If you're not sure where to save, Documents is a safe bet, but feel free to select the folder that fits your organizational system best. If needed, you can also create a new folder directly from the Save dialog to better categorize your files. Finally, after selecting the folder, click Save. At this point, your document is now securely stored on your computer, and you can easily access it anytime without worrying about internet connectivity or cloud storage. And that's it. You've successfully saved your Word file to your local PC, ensuring you have control over where your data resides. This method is particularly helpful if you're working in environments where internet access might fluctuate or if you're prioritizing privacy and immediate access to your documents. Thanks for joining me today and I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Be sure to subscribe for more tips and tricks on managing your digital